This year, I discovered what happens when the means become the end. That last buzzer sounded, and in an instant, my junior basketball season was over. The game had consumed me and had been my passion since I decided at age four that I wanted to play in the NBA. But at the end of this game, I felt an unfamiliar sense of relief. I stood in the opposing team's gym, trying to convince myself that I wished we had another game, but I couldn't. When we got back to school, I sat in our locker room in dead silence. As everybody left, I thought about what I was looking forward to now that basketball season was over. I was passionate about taking my own fitness, both physical and mental, to the next level. I had reached a crossroads. Basketball wasn't necessarily the problem, but I had learned that it wasn't my solution either. In that moment, I decided that fitness in and of itself would be my goal. That day was the launch of my fitness journey, a decision that's just gotten better every day. I started off by training consistently, improving as best I could, physically and mentally. In order to become the best version of myself, I lifted heavier weights, training my mind to go beyond my comfort zone. As time passed, I created an Instagram account to chronicle my fitness journey and share it with others who might be at the same crossroads I was. I posted pictures, gave lots of advice and encouragement, and shared workout routines, showing people what has worked best for me and why. Branching out, I created a YouTube channel as another way of sharing my story with a wider audience. Making each YouTube video is a time-consuming process, from concept to execution to editing. For a while, I was stuck with about 100 followers and couldn't seem to expand my reach. I was confident in myself and knew that if I just stayed consistent and just continued to work hard, network, and engage, that I would start to see results. A couple weeks passed and I could start to see my numbers trending upward as I shared more content. Within a few months, I had reached about a thousand followers and was feeling really proud of what I had accomplished. Currently, I have 10,000 followers, hundreds of YouTube subscribers, and because of all of this, I have been given so many amazing opportunities. I have been a fitness ambassador for many brands, been sent clothing and food for promotional purposes, and am in the midst of signing with a management company. Although exciting, those materialistic gains have no real impact on my life. The messages I get from my followers, however, are beyond fulfilling. They are the reason I do what I do. Messages like, I can clearly tell you're humble and believe in people, validates that people out there are genuinely understanding my purpose. No matter what tangible items I receive, they will never compare to my sense of fulfillment. This has all happened in the past six months, and I'm hopeful that it's only the beginning. Most importantly, the feedback and support I've gotten from family, friends, my followers, and others are unmatched. I could not be more grateful and appreciative for all the love I have been shown. I set out to share my passion for fitness, and in doing so, realized that my real passion is inspiring others. I am simply using fitness as my platform to make that possible. I aspire to be the best version of myself while inspiring others to do the same. This is my message and life philosophy and every single day I remind myself of this mission and continue to strive to fulfill it.